any health-related information on the following show provides general information only. Content presented on any show by any host or guest should not be substituted for a doctor's advice. Always consult your physician before beginning any new diet, exercise, or treatment program. Welcome to Accelerated Health TV and Radio Show. Happy New Year. I'm your host, Sarah Banta. I'm a health coach, natural supplement expert, and a busy mom of three. Make sure you hit the subscribe button below so you're notified every week with my new podcast on Mondays and Tuesdays. And if you haven't already, join my free group coaching on Telegram with the link below. I teach you on a daily basis with tips and tools to enhance your health, and you'll be a part of a like-minded group to support you on your journey, in addition to truly taking control of your health in 2024. My goal is to reach everyone on earth with eyes to see and ears to hear my message of healing, so help me with that goal. Share this podcast with a few of your friends who may need my help. I'm so excited. The holidays are behind us. You guys are probably feeling like, okay, the stress is over. The family stuff's over. I got a little sick. I was eating and drinking a little too much. And my body just feels, oh, and I get it. Even me, um, as, as much as I stay on track and I don't really drink alcohol, I still feel icky after the holidays and I feel so excited to jump into this new year with new goals in my mind, body, and spirit. So join the group Telegram. That is going to be motivation in itself. There's no downside, like I said, and you will just learn on a daily basis. And I look back to when I found myself at my rock bottom I had PCOS, Crohn's disease, heavy metal toxicity, my lead, mercury, aluminum were through the roof off the charts, insulin resistance. I didn't really have a weight problem, but I still had insulin resistance, um, hair loss, acne, no energy. And I was uncovering all of my health issues. I realized that all of the symptoms led back to the same problems And it's all packed in that holiday season of toxins because we're eating foods that may not be organic, which is a big deal now. It may have not been a big deal 20 years ago when we were younger. Now it is. Insulin resistance, things that are hidden causing that insulin resistance, not just the extra um, eggnog and alcohol and dessert that you had during the holidays, the radiation and some of the other hidden things that we're going to talk about. All of that stuff built up in our bodies and it's time to clear them out. So what I learned was I had to build my body back up at my rock bottom, but I had to detox as well. And sometimes detox is not so fun. And that's where I come in with some supplements and tools to make it so that you feel great. Day one, it's like going into the gym January 1st, and you swear that you're going to go five days a week. And day three, you're like, I can't do this anymore. And you give up. I'm going to make it and give you the tools so that you don't want to give up. So why are we um, going to look into detox for resetting our health for the new year? You got to detox. Um, It's a process aimed at removing those harmful substances out of the body Some people say, some of the doctors will say, oh, you shouldn't be detoxing your liver and your kidneys do it on on its own. Yeah, for our ancestors, they did a great job. But we have been bombarding our our detox pathways and and our liver and our kidneys so much that they're stacked up, they're backed up and they want to give up. They can't do as much as we're asking. The amount of toxins and radiation we are facing is exponentially higher than what our ancestors dealt with and is way too high for our naturally detoxifying organs to handle. Um, How is insulin resistance related? Well, the high levels of toxins in our environment are making insulin resistance worse by inhibiting the function of the liver and the cells at the cellular level. The liver is responsible for not only detoxification, but also for protein and fat metabolism, 
thyroid function? Are you suffering from a slow metabolism? Are you looking to Ozempic or one of the other drugs because you've gained this unexplained weight gain? It also the liver's connected to the metabolism from processing fructose and glucose. Therefore, if the liver's backed up by the toxins, then insulin resistance is going to be worse. And in, if insulin resistance is present, the liver is not functioning right and it's a vicious cycle. Insulin resistance manifests in different metabolic diseases within the body. Diabetes is insulin resistance at the liver. Heart disease, insulin resistance at the heart. PCOS, which I had, was insulin resistance at the ovaries. Alzheimer's is insulin resistance of the brain. So all of these things might be manifesting in your body in a different way. Another reason that we got to reset our health for the new year. Um, you may not be overweight. So you may think, oh, I, it's okay. But how's your brain fog? How's your constipation? How's your energy? How's um, the, the water retention in your body? How is your cardiovascular health when you try to work out? Do you feel like your lungs aren't working as well? Signs you need a detox, those are some. Some others are unexplained weight gain, um, headaches, um, unexplained lack of motivation. That's a new one. And that actually is connected to the spike protein. Bloat, water retention, anger, depression, or anxiety. Your mood just has changed. Uh, hair loss, skin breakouts. I heard from a, a client today who's actually a very fit influencer and she's doing my cleanse and she said, Sarah, why is my skin breaking out? Oh, by the way, um, could it be related to the antibiotics I've been on? And I'm like, yes, your skin is your largest organ. organ. It's telling you it's trying to get rid of these toxins and the gut and you got to take care of your gut. It's all related to the skin. So if you're having skin breakouts, another, another sign that you need to detox. Joint pain, insomnia, nausea, bumps on the back of your arm, that's a sign that you can't process fat, and your liver is not um, breaking down that fat. Weakened immune system, and just systemic inflammation. I've talked about how um, you can go and do an in-body scan for body composition, but it also tells you your intracellular hydration and your extracellular hydration. We want that intracellular hydration for the health of our cells, but that extracellular hydration is inflammation. That is not what we want. So why do you want to complete a detox? It's not just about um, that trendy thing to do to lose weight. We've got lots of reasons. You've got the heavy metals, lead, mercury, and lead, by the way, has been in the news um, at, the, at the governmental level. They are, they are looking more into the lead toxicity. Lead can make you crazy in the brain, actually, and so can mercury and aluminum. Lead, mercury, and aluminum are just a few of the toxins that they're finding their ways into our bodies through the air, water, and food. So even if you're eating all organic and doing everything you think you're doing right, it's coming through the air. I live underneath an, an airplane um, flight path. I'm getting those toxins every single day. Heavy metals can cause that neurological effect, gastrointestinal issues, cardiovascular issues, kidney damage, liver damage, respiratory issues, bone health issues, infertility, immune system issues, cancer, chronic health conditions. And then you add into it, what do we have attached to our appendage is this 5G cell phone radiation independent of the food consumption. So you're not eating a morsel of chocolate. Radiation from non-ionizing and ionizing radiation can increase insulin resistance in addition to altering the nervous system, the endocrine system, and the hormonal system. That means your thyroid. That means your metabolism. That means your liver. That means everything in your body. Radiation also increases oxidative stress and free radical damage, the things that are going to accelerate our aging. Um, do you know that in the Bible, there's they talk about people leaving, living to a 900? Our um, lifespan is shortening with every generation. And there's a reason. Why is that? 
Well, we've got all of these toxins, radiation, heavy metals. Radiation is um, increasing because of 5G, smart meters, computers, the smartphones, all of the technology has increased ex exponentially over the last three years. To worsen the situation, Fukushima nuclear power plant began releasing treated radioactive water into the Pacific Ocean last August. That was in the news. What were they not telling us? So that's just what they are telling us. Think about it. Um, the levels have increased significantly. It's a way different world than it was just five, 10 years ago. Then you have the dietary toxins. The toxins in the food supply, the water and the water supply have increased exponentially. So not just the GMOs and the glyphosate coming from our crops, but there are dioxins, highly toxic compounds found in industrial farming processes in our conventionally raised meats. Now, me, I eat organic, grass-fed, wild animal protein in my house. Over the holidays, a lot of my meals were out of my control. I had um, farm-raised beef. I actually got food poisoning. But not just that, I also got exposed to people in rooms where um, we were all there at a party sharing our viral and our bacterial breath and then eating these foods that are not so clean as I'm used to. And then my liver's stacking up all of these things that are um, compounding the issue. I got food poisoning. I got a hit with a virus. It wasn't COVID, but it was a virus. Massive headache, gut issues, um, just felt awful. Thank goodness for all of my tips and supplements and clean eating um, that I could follow it up with. I bounced back within 24 hours and we're going to get into that. But that is why we need to be resetting our health, not just about weight, guys. It's about your immune system, longevity and getting the most out of every day so you're feeling good to um, truly live your life, right? So we've got the, the dietary toxins. Then you have the halogens, which include fluoride. Are you guys still using fluor fluoridated uh, toothpaste? You gotta throw it away. Refer back to my um, podcast with Nathan Bryan, Dr. Nathan Bryan about nitric oxide. Fluoride, mouthwash, and antacids are the quickest way to kill the nitric oxide in your, in your body. And just by using mouthwash, you are eliminating the benefits of your workout that you're going to that gym for um, starting, starting in this January, right? So that fluoride, the mouthwash, antacids, all of them are very toxic to the body. And that's in the water and the food supply. These clog the liver, clog the iodine receptor sites in all 100 trillion cells of the body, including the thyroid. So that could be why your metabolism is slowing down. I had someone actually say to me the other day, yes, I'm taking Ozempic because um, I wish I had your metabolism, Sarah. I'm like, you could have my metabolism if you detoxed your thyroid and your liver. It will come back. I had hypothyroidism, I had Hashimoto's, it has reversed and all of my symptoms have been uh, alleviated. Then you add in the processed foods. So I try to stay away from these as much as possible, but over the holidays, I can't um, resist the desserts. I might be able to resist the bread, but you put a cake or some frosting in front of me, I'm going to eat it, unfortunately. But these processed foods manufactured by the big food corporations have negatively impact the health of so many, and they're the leading culprit of insulin resistance and toxicity. And to dive deeper into it, revert back to uh, my podcast with Dr. Robert Lustig. It, it's, a, it's a crazy, you know, before 1980s, we did not have processed foods. That's why my parents' generation and your parents' generation did not have as many weight issues or chronic health conditions. Yes, they were eating carbs, but they weren't eating processed foods. The processed foods are filled with extra fructose, inflammatory seed oils, the GMO grains, artificial sweeteners, which we think are healthy, right? No, 
They're not. They're actually triggering an insulin response and creating uh, wreaking havoc in the body already. And the natural fiber has been extracted from them. So they are accelerating the development of insulin resistance and clogging the detox pathways in the body. This is a recipe for disaster, and it's only getting worse. 62% of the adults, um, adults' diet is coming from processed foods. And so that rate of insulin resistance, type 2 diabetes, and non-alcoholic fatty liver are increasing significantly. 45% of you have fatty liver and you don't even know it. And you're not an alcoholic. Maybe you are, but that's not even the reason that you have fatty liver. So why is this happening? This insulin resistance is um, increasing significantly because of a few things. That fructose is not metabolized like regular sugar or glucose. It's converting directly into liver fat, not used for energy. And fructose lowers, subtracts that ATP, which is cellular energy. Mitochondrial health is the goal. We want mitochondrial health. And fructose is actually decreasing mitochondrial health. Then you don't have the fiber in the processed foods. Fiber is nature's way of slowing the rise of the blood glucose in the insulin and with and insulin um, with foods in the processed foods. Without the fiber, the blood sugar is spiking, causing more insulin be, to be needed and leading to insulin resistance quicker. So, try to eat five oranges, you'll throw up. Have orange juice, juice from five oranges, you'll ask for when is breakfast because the orange juice doesn't have the, the fiber. The seed oils cause inflammation in the cells and lead to the cells becoming resistant to insulin. These oils can be found in even organic soups at Whole Foods. So look at the packaging. Um, organic um, cold pressed canola oil is still canola oil. It's still a seed oil. You want to stay away from these oils, canola, corn, soybean, rice bran, safflower, sunflower, grape seed, and peanut oil. The artificial sweeteners, they may not have the calories, but they are increasing the cravings for sugar and the more processed foods, and that's leading to overconsumption. And then they're all hyper palatable. So you're combining fat, sugar, and salt all in the processed foods. Those three things don't come together in nature. That's why if you stick to whole foods, you won't have this addictive nature in the, with this hyper palatable food. The processed foods are blunting your normal taste buds. So that's going to lead to overeating of the high sugar foods. Um, and those foods that are come with fat and carbs together, nuts and dairy, those are meant to fatten up the animals in nature. Those are the only two that actually have the, and they don't even have the sugar, right? So fats and carbs don't come in nature together unless they are nuts and dairy, and that's meant to fatten up the animal. Emulsifiers, these are killing your gut. And we talk a lot about leaky gut. Make sure you look back at Karan Krishnan and all of our episodes talking about leaky gut. They destroy the mucosal lining of the gut that measures the incoming nutrients that register how hungry you are. And they kill that signaling of the CCK hormone in the brain to shut off the appetite. Well, why are people doing Ozempic, right? To shut down their appetite just by eating foods that can trigger CCK and having the signaling work in your body can shut down your appetite. We're going to talk about those in a minute. Um, gluten and grains in these processed foods, they steal nutrients out of the body, cause leaky gut, and um, they've got toxins like the glyphosate and GMOs. These processed foods cause addiction. We need to get off these foods because that is causing you to feel crazy like you don't have willpower. It's not about willpower. It's not your fault. It is these foods. They are meant to create addiction. Stick to whole foods and you will see that you will not overeat. So the, the benefits of cleansing and detoxing, you're eliminating the toxins right? You're opening up the detox pathways and then minimizing the toxins um, that you have been exposed to by eating the foods that I'm going to talk about. 
and you're filling up your receptor sites with supplements like Acceleridine iodine that is kicking out the heavy metals radiation and halogens like the fluoride and the bromide and the chlorine. Um, even Nathan Bryan, he was talking about how, yes, he removes the fluoride for nitric oxide, but he takes iodine um, daily. So you want to eliminate the alcohol. And I know dry January is the time to do it, right? But all the excess sugar in the processed foods, and that will minimize the toxic burden on the body. Do you need to be on a ketogenic diet? No, you need to focus on your protein. We'll get into that in a little bit, but we're going to reduce insulin resistance through the cleansing. And a lot of that is coming from um, the accelerated keto, the accelerated iodine, the accelerated ancient salt. Those three supplements, and those three supplements are in most of the cleanses, but those three supplements are going to lower your sugar cravings, lower your blood sugar, iodine and salt on their own has been shown to lower insulin resistance and lower blood sugar. Um, and then you put in the accelerated keto and that's going to help help curb your cravings. But all of that, those factors are going to help you intermittent fast, which is going to um, maximize your detoxification results. Just by intermittent fasting, you're going to improve and detox your, your body. These cleanses are, are helping your digestion. Um, with, the co with the combination of the supplements we talk about, constipation, bloat, gas, nausea are minimized. Intermittent fasting on its own is going to help heal the gut. Um, but many people find it hard to fast, and that's where the accelerated keto comes in to suppress the appetite and make it easy easier for anyone to engage in fasting. I've had people say, Sarah, I can't fast. I eat from the morning, a moment I wake up till nine at night, or even sometimes wake up in the middle of the night. And that's because their blood sugar is dropping, inducing a need for sugar. Well, they will then start the accelerated keto and say, okay, it's noon. I'm not hungry. What's going on? This is weird. Um, so it has helped with that as well. Um, weight loss. So many detox programs restrict caloric intake, encourage juicing, and these detox pro programs may result in short-term weight loss, but it's causing the body to shift into survival mode, slow down the metabolism, and then you're going to start eating again and you're hangry. No one wants to live with you. You're going to lose muscle mass and fat loss or fat mass and especially the water. And then you start eating again. You're going to gain it back. You're going to slow down that metabolism. So when you start eating the same amount of calories again, you actually gain weight. So you're going to lower that metabolism. The combination of the accelerated iodine, accelerated thyroid, and accelerated keto in most of the, my cleanses um, increase your metabolism, increase that ATP, and increase fat burning without shifting into survival and starvation mode. Um, you're going to increase your energy by not eating those processed food and those harmful substances combine that with energy inducing supplements and you're going to see an increase in your cellular energy and your mitochondria, uh, your immune system. So like I mentioned during the holidays, you have that extra layer of stress that's going to suppress your immune system. Then you add in the foods that you're not used to eating in the extra layer of the toxins in the food and on top of just the sugar all of that is suppressing your immune system. And then you're around everybody in those parties that no one's going to miss out on the partying and they're going to show up with their sniffles or that extra virus. And that immune system has been um, compromised. The accelerated iodine and the accelerated colloidal silver are known, both of them independently, to devitalize foreign pathogens including bacteria, viruses, parasites, and more. And when they're paired with a low-carb diet, full of that nutrient-dense, real, wild animal protein, the immune system becomes optimized. And that is why I was able to bounce back within 24 hours. 
is my immune system was like, okay, thanks for the tools. I'm good to go. Um, these cleanses, a, a couple of them will with the, the a talk with the intermittent fasting is going to induce autophagy and autophagy is your body's way of having the cells use their own components to rebuild new cells and clean up the junk. They say, okay, I'm not eating right now. Let's go clean up. I always think of it as like Pac-Man. Pac-Man's going through and just cleaning up all the junk as it doesn't have to worry about digesting food at the moment. It's triggered naturally by fasting, exercise, and a low-carb diet. With the accelerated keto and the um, accelerated iodine, autophagy is triggered even quicker and more is happening within the body. So it's doing it, it's much more effective than with just fasting or exercise alone. You will see clear skin. So the skin, it's the, it's the largest organ. And if you're toxic, and you're inflamed, your skin's going to show you. Inflammation in the skin is the redness, and it could be rosacea or zits or acne. Um, but what happens is as you're detoxing, you are pulling the toxins out of the tissues into the bloodstream. So you might, you might temporarily have a breakout, and that's the body saying, thank you for cleaning me out. I need to get rid of these toxins. But that's where the accelerated cellular detox powder comes in because it soaks up those toxins much quicker than doing a detox on its own. Um, you will see an improvement in, the, in your complexion at the end of the cleanse. Like I said, the skin is the largest detox organ. So when they're expelled from the skin, it will become more clear and more vibrant. And now we also have the accelerated um, facelift mask that you can put on your face or any part of your body to soak up and clear out those toxins much quicker and the skin is is much quicker quicker to be clear and even my teenage kids who um you know are very very skeptical of everything i say because i just talk about health all the time um they love the mask because it helps with their teenage acne so you will see a reduction in inflammation in the body. So all of these toxins, all of the insulin resistance, all of the seed oils, everything that we've been exposed to is causing inflammation throughout the body. Um, these cleanses are going to help with reducing that inflammation and, and um, every supplement is working synergistically together to do so. You're going to see a difference in your mental clarity. I have, you know, family members who don't have any weight issues. They're in their 80s and they are only taking my supplements because of physical injuries. They've seen a difference in their mental clarity because of the combination of the supplements, especially the accelerated iodine the accelerated keto, the accelerated silver, and then you add in the Cognoblast, and that is only going to help that mental clarity, the mood, and the focus. The Some of my, my most comprehensive cleanse, the Accelerate or the, the Ascent Diet Cleanse, you are actually going to see a release of stones, liver stones, into the toilet and cleanse that, that, um, that liver, which, like I mentioned, is the number one detox um, organ. So why, what cleanses are there? What should you do? Um, there's so many to choose from, but the top cleanse and the one that we're starting January 8th of this year. So join in, it's not too late. And then we're going to be doing it every first Monday of every month for 2024 is the Ascent Diet Cleanse. It's the most comprehensive cleanse. It's going to detox, reset, and rebuild your whole system. It's going to target the fat loss and keep your muscle, support that insulin resistance and fatty liver, reverse uric acid levels. Uric acid is connected to fatty liver and insulin resistance. It's going to help lower your cholesterol, reduce your cravings, suppress the appetite, heal your leaky gut, improve sleep, improve mood and focus, and then get those gallstones out. The accelerated keto detox cleanse. So this is for those 
who don't want to do the liver flush. They're like, I just can't go there. The accelerated keto detox cleanse is essentially very similar to the Ascent Diet Cleanse without the liver flush. And you're going to get all of the same results without cleansing the liver. So you're not getting that big bang at the end. Um, and that big bang of the liver flush is going to speed up the metabolism and enhance your results that much that much higher. So you can always do the accelerated keto detox cleanse and then add in the liver flush um, if you choose to afterwards. And that liver flush, what it's decide, designed to do, if you wanted to do just the liver flush, you don't want to do any of the other supplements, it is desi designed to flush the gallstones and liver stones out of the body. It's going to help with pain, cramps, inflammation, reset your AST and ALT liver enzyme count, which is going to help um, your doctor become a lot more happy with you, support damaged liver cells being replaced with the healthy ones, get rid of the toxins and the pollutants, um, support that healthy liver from um, drug and alcohol damage that maybe you did over the past from an addiction or just the holidays. And it will help clear out the unhealthy uh, cholesterol deposits um, help with the obstructions in the liver and the gallbladder, improve the immune system, and it's also going to regenerate the healthy liver and the gallbladder cleanse. Now, before I move on, I just want to say that the, the spike protein and the pandemic and everything that we've been exposed to, I have to be very careful with how I speak about this, that has put this new layer of um, burden on our livers. And that is why you might not have changed anything, even through the holidays. Maybe you're someone who doesn't drink, you don't eat out, you don't do anything that I've talked about, but your cholesterol's increased, your insulin resistance has increased, fatty liver. Um, some of these markers don't make sense. Spike protein. The spike protein has affected the ACE2 receptor in the liver, and it's affected the fat and protein metabolism in the liver. So this is why the liver flush is so important to do at least four times a year. I'm doing it about every six weeks now, and I really feel a shift in my body. Um, now, where you can start um, with one other option for a cleanse if you these cleanses have sounded too much for you, but maybe you just need to get your bowels moving. Maybe you just need to get rid of the constipation. The accelerated colon cleanse helps um, with pooping and cleansing the colon. It plays a crucial role in expelling the waste, eliminating the toxins. If you're constipated, you're just reabsorbing those toxins and you have a congested colon and your body's going to reabsorb those toxins into the blood bloodstream and actually increase that estrogen dominance. Because if the estrogens can't get out of the body, they're just going to reabsorb. And you also are able to get rid of a mucoid plaque. That consists of a combination of mucus and other substances that accumulate within the intestines and colon. It forms a thick rubbery layer that has the potential to be harmful and it actually can clog your colon. So if you start seeing some of this, this tar type stuff come out of you, you're getting out that mucoid plaque. Um, so it's, um, it's imperative to address this and remove this buildup. You want to aim for two to three daily bowel movements. And people are saying, I'm not constipated. I go, go poop every other day. You're constipated. Think about babies. They poop when they eat. So it's really important to be pooping more often throughout the day to get out those toxins. It's going to eliminate the toxins. And this cleanse is going to help with the regular bowel movements. I've had people who don't go to the bathroom except for once a week. And the cleanse, the colon cleanse is working like magic. And you will see a boost in energy levels, relief from bloat and intestinal discomfort. There's nothing worse than being constipated. Um, okay. The radiation and heavy metal detox cleanse. This cleanse includes the accelerodyne because not only is that helping with your thyroid and your, um, your metabolism, 
but it's actually detoxing every cell in your body. It's detoxing the heavy metals, the radiation, um, and the toxins in our food. In all 100 trillion cells of the body, you've got the accelerodyne, the silver, the nuke no more, which is known to detox of, of all of the non-ionizing and ionizing radiation. And then you have the accelerated silver and the accelerated cellular detox powder. It's amazing. It improves ATP and mitochondrial health, cellular hydration, reduces your risk of chronic disease. And that is a great place for anyone to start who doesn't really want to change their diet. You're still going to see a difference. And everyone really needs to, to go through that. Now, the Nuke No More is a supplement that I recommend going through two bottles of it on a daily. Uh, so taking 12 drops every day until you finish two bottles worth. And then you want to take it um, at least four days a week, depending on your exposure to radiation. Are you on your computer every day, your cell phone, or are you flying and traveling? If you're traveling, you want to do it every day. You can also choose with from the Anytime Reset Detox Cleanse. So this is the most basic cleanse who are for those not wanting to intermittent fast or follow a low carb diet, you will still boost the immune system, boost the metabolism, increase energy, clear the brain fog, and gently eliminate the toxins. That is not going to include the accelerated keto. It's not going to um, help with that the intermittent fasting, but you're still going to get the benefits of the the accelerated silver and the accelerodyne and the accelerated detox powder. You're also going to get the mega spore to help heal the gut and give your body the right spore biotics. Those who know that they have candida, the accelerated candida cleanse. This is designed not to only kill off the candida effectively, but also help negate the die-off symptoms that many people experience. A lot of people don't want to do a candida cleanse because of this flu um, symptoms situation that they get. And candida is the most common fungal pathogen that causes candida uh, or overgrowth in the body, colonizes in the skin and mucosal surfaces, and the accelerated candida cleanse protocol supports that healthy fungal balance in the gut. And it's been fantastic. I have done it. My kids have done it. Um, it also can help clear up skin because sometimes candida will want to come out of the skin. With the extra sugar that you've eaten over the holidays, candida loves to proliferate. It is feeding off of that sugar. So it is. Um, it also will cause your sugar cravings to um, be very high. So when you get rid of the candida, your sugar cravings should come down. You also have the accelerated parasite cleanse. This is not only to purge out parasites out of the system, but also helps boost the immune system, help with digestive issues, supports overwhelm, over overall uh, mental and physical energy and helps with everything that you're feeling. Parasites can make you crazy. They can cause headaches. Um, they can also cause bloat and they, you know, candida is a parasite. So they go hand in hand, but you're going to eliminate the chronic infestations of the intestinal parasites, clear those intestinal inf infections, help with nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, supports the immune system in de devitalizing all foreign pathogens, not just parasites. Parasites are tough. Um, it's something that takes a couple weeks, not just uh, not just a week or, you know, if depending on how much you have in your body, it could take a couple months actually. There's the accelerated kidney stone cleanse that you can choose from, and this will help dissolve urinary and kidney stones, promote uh, blood circulation, help with edema and water retention, improve thyroid and metabolism, reduce symptoms of gout, help with joint pain, arthritis. Who knew that your kidneys were related to that, right? It will help with the urinary tract, bladder, and kidney infections. Um, and then you can also choose from the, the bladder cleanse. 
the accelerated bladder cleanse. And this is helping with any bacterial um, infection that plays a role in urinary tract and bladder infection. So those are the cleanses. Now, what I do recommend, why, why the accelerated, I want to touch on this, is in all, I think it's in almost every single one of those, it is essential because it's antiviral, antifungal, antibacterial, antimicrobial, and then it also is going to detox the liver. It's also going to help with um, that estrogen dominance. It's also going to increase the metabolism and the thyroid health, clear the brain fog, and it help with inflammation, free radicals, allergies, histamines, and it's pushing out the toxins, the heavy metals, the radiation that are disrupting the body's optimal state of health. So iodine, acceleridine, especially because it's the only monoatomic iodine that's radiation free and scalar charged to neutralize the radiation in the body. And it's the only iodine that is 100% absorbed. The accelerated, accelerated colloidal silver is also in almost every, I think it's in every single one except for the, the colon cleanse. Um, why it's so important? Improving circulation, strengthening the immune system, supporting detoxification, and it's enhanced with scalar frequencies to help clear that emotional and physical shock from the body, improve the health of the thymus, improve lung function, devitalize viruses and bacteria. It is also a game changer for kids' health as well. Um, accelerated keto. That is in most of the, the big cleanses like um, the, the, acceler the keto cleanse and also the ascent diet cleanse. It is helping with the intermittent fasting and the sugar cravings. So if you're someone that has those cravings, that is the game changer is the accelerated keto. It is going to put your body into ketosis within 30 minutes, burning fat, maintaining that muscle mass, helping with mental and physical energy, and your body can go to work on cleansing. It's also enhanced with scalar frequencies to cleanse the liver on a daily basis, gently convert saturated fat to unsaturated fat, and increase your metabolic rate. So if you are one that is wanting to get on Ozempic, try the accelerated keto first with the accelerated iodine and the accelerated thyroid. And the accelerated thyroid is for everybody. Most people are suffering from um, hypothyroidism since the pandemic, and it will help increase metabolism, fat burning, physical and mental energy, prevent fatty liver, strengthen your tissues and bones, help elevate your mood and your hormonal balance. And we, we have also put frequencies in it to um, detox the thyroid from the toxins and the radiation that we've been talking about. Accelerated cellular detox powder. This is also in most of the supplement and uh, most of the cleanses. It's soaking up the toxins that we're releasing through the cleanses and helps with regularity and boat bloat. And the formula has been enhanced, and I'm so excited. It works so much better. You are going to love it. It feels amazing, and you feel it soak up the clean the toxins and it helps with bowel movements as well. It is also enhanced with scalar frequencies to detox the body of all of the toxins that we've talked about as well. Now, what do you need to do in addition to the supplements? You wanna focus on that wild animal protein, right? Um, that protein is the most nutrient dense food that you can use to um, nurture your body and your tissue, tissues. It's much more important than cleansing with the vegetables or the juicing, right? You want to have one to 1.2 grams of wild animal protein per pound of desired lean body mass. That's going to help you detox the body from the toxins in the other food, improve insulin resistance and fatty liver, minimize your cravings for the foods that we were eating over the holidays, suppress the appetite, build that lean muscle mass, and trigger that hormone, CCK, which suppresses appetite and supports that lean muscle gains. If you're doing Ozempic, you're losing muscle and fat at the same time. Um, the wild animal protein, what does that look like? Lamb, bison, deer, grass-fed beef, elk, wild salmon, arctic char, 
those foods have all of the nutrients um, or more nutrients than any other vegetable or food on earth. So you want to stay away from sources like chicken, poultry, and conventionally raised beef because they contain the inflammatory proteins called amyloids. And those are tripping up the spike protein, causing gut um, inflammation and gut pathogens to take over, leading to Alzheimer's dementia, tripping up the, the fat burning mechanisms. They're just a no, no good um, source of food because it's actually going to make things worse. You want to limit your certain vegetables, the ones with sulfur or oxalates. And if you don't know what those are, go to the accelerated food guide. That is going to list out all of the foods that you want to focus on and stay away from. So most grains, beans, non-organic starchy um, vegetables are, that are full of GMOs, they're high in carbohydrates and increasing insulin resistance and tripping up the, the detox path, pathways. And they're also known to cause leaky gut extract the nutrients from the body. So here you are eating these beans and grains and you think you're getting your nutrients in. They're actually stealing nutrients out of the body. Um, we need to start moving our bodies. If you don't exercise and you think you're going to go straight into buying that gym membership and going to the gym every day, don't. Let's start small. Let's start walking, get a dog, um, walk for 15 minutes at a time, a couple times a day, do some squats in your living room, get some hand weights or some rubber bands, go on YouTube and start watching some free videos. If you have been, you know, a gym goer, but got off the, off the cycle, get back into it and have a buddy. Um, that's going to help you a lot. And also joining the, the group coaching where everyone in the group coaching does encourage each other and help each other keep motivated. You can also use a couple other supplements I will just mention is that accelerated copper. Um, that is not in any of the any of the um, cleanses, but copper has been depleted by the processed foods, the spike protein, and it's been shown to be a key to weight loss for those with unexplained weight gain. It works synergistically with all of the cleanses we've talked about. It helps with the increased energy, improved hair growth, improved skin, bone, and tissue health, and accelerated scalar copper is the only copper supplement with 100% absorption. Most others have only 5 to 10% absorption. It helps decrease uric acid, fatty liver, and insulin resistance through multiple ways. Um, your body cannot metabolize fat without copper. It's just that simple. I would also recommend adding in the Mega Spore Biotic to any of the cleanses. This is going to help with your leaky gut. Most people walking around, including me, after I've had some holiday cake, is going to have some leaky gut. And leaky gut is the cornerstone of mo most diseases and health issues. Megaspore Biotic is going to support the repair of the gut microbiome, and you can add in the full leaky gut bundle to make the results much quicker. Um, this is different than any typical probiotic. Most probiotics have too many of, uh, you know, a few strains. So it's going to overpopulate your gut with not enough of the right stuff, but too much of the wrong stuff. This is different. The megaspore has a brain. It gets down into where it needs to be. And then it will say, oh, I need more of this. I need more of that, but I don't need more of this. So anyways, that is the, the cleanses. Um, it is January. It's time to reset your health for the new year. There's lots of cleanses to choose from with your tolerance. There's a quiz on the website where you can tap in, take the quiz, see which one is right for you according to your symptoms and your tolerance. I'm not someone that cured myself within a month within a January. This has been a long journey of health and I continue to learn and stay on top of the cutting edge nuances of diet, of what's going on in the world, of supplements, of frequency healing, things that you can incorporate in your, in your protocol 
let me know what how I can help you. Um, so I want you to be encouraged to join the free group coaching. Take a step for your health in 2024. It's time. It's time to get on top of it and take that control back. Thanks for joining me today. So like I said, if I can help you with your health issues, contact me directly through the website, sarahbantahealth.com. Happy to put together a protocol for you. And in the group Telegram, um, group coaching on Telegram with the link below, you can add in a comment or a question there. I will answer on a daily basis and you will get support from the whole group. You can follow me on Facebook and Instagram under Accelerated Health Products across over 100 channels under Accelerated Health TV and Radio Show. My goal is to reach everyone on earth with eyes to see and ears to hear my message of healing. So help me with that goal. Share this podcast with a few of your friends who may need my help and you want them to join you in a cleanse to have a body buddy so you can encourage each other. Join us every week on Mondays at 2 p.m. Pacific and Tuesdays at 1 p.m. Pacific. And you can find all of the supplements at sarabantahealth.com. Use coupon WELCOME10 for 10% off site-wide. Thanks again for joining us here and have a great week.